Boston begins its phase three today. Logan Airport is seeing more passengers take to the skies. So who's traveling? This flight just landed from Orlando, Florida, where some Bostonians say they traveled for vacation. Others getting back from their second home. I was on vacation. How long were you down there? Like 10, 9 days. The airport reporting a slow but steady uptick in travel since the start of the pandemic. Numbers released today show year over year departures down 81 and a half percent. At Terminal C, we found this group heading to the Dominican Republic on JetBlue. Air travel is growing nationwide. And new data shows the coronavirus outbreak did not slow holiday travel in the nation's COVID-19 hotspots. A company that tracks movement for the CDC found more people hit the road over the July 4th weekend than Memorial Day. That includes areas battling large outbreaks. In fact, Orlando saw the largest increase. Experts have said mobility is one of the biggest risk factors when it comes to transmission of the virus. And Governor Baker is still asking those returning to Massachusetts from the majority majority of states to quarantine for 14 days. Passengers on this Orlando flight say they'll stay put if they can. Go home and stay inside as long as I can. Well, I have to go back to work, so I plan on getting the test and then waiting for the results and then going back to work. Officials here at Logan say a few international flights have started back up and running, including flights to Portugal and Air France to Paris. At Logan Airport, I'm Katie Thompson, WCVB News Center 5.